of the order Rodentia. Almost half of all mammals are their kind, so populous are rodents. Rodents live everywhere but Antarctica. Even the Arctic, yeah, the Arctic, it has rodents. Captain Barra, the largest rodentia found in South America, live in dense forests and savannas. Sharing facts about some rodents Date back to the Paleocene At least marked out by incisor teeth That grow and grow continuously Rodents Went to Australia and New Guinea With no help from human beings The only terrestrial placental mammals That did that, you see Pygmy Jerboa is the smallest rodentia. Not a lot on Wikipedia about this dwarf three toed Jerboa. Here's something they can induce hypothermia to live on little food and water. Just sharing facts about some rodents. Hey, is a mole a rodent? No, because they don't have a single pair of continuously growing incisors in each of the upper and lower jaws. Oh, but is a vole a rodent? Obviously, because... Wait, let me guess. Incisors? Yep, rodents. Some have cheek pouches lined with fur. They can be turned inside out. For sure, it's true. Amazing things some rodents do. Recognize family by smelling their poo and pee. That's gross, but nature can be strange, you see. Hey, can I do one? Sure. Rabbits. Rabbits. The cutest rodentia. Lewis. So soft and so cuddly. Ah. Oh, boy. They ate chocolate eggs one time each year. I can tell you feel strongly about this. They are not rodents. They're not? What are they? Lagomorphs are related to rodentia. They share a great, 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 great grandmama, but lagomorphs are not rodentia. Now back to rodents. You've learned so much, you see. Some rodents right beside you, but you can't see them. 